just a dream? Mr. President, we still haven't found any weapons of mass destruction. You have found weapons of mass destruction. Uh, hi. We have it. You have. I don't know what you're doing. Bring me a taco. Yes, sir. <laughs> Tacos rule. Hi, everyone, and welcome to... <laughs> I can't keep a straight face because of that. Uh, welcome to today's episode of Facts About the President of the United States. Oh, man, we got an interesting one for you today. Here on, uh, oh, what is today? Sunday, October 21st. Yeah. Three more days. Well, actually, two, not counting today. So we have Obama tomorrow and Trump on Tuesday. We're almost done, guys. But anyways, we're talking about George W. Bush uh, for today. He was a Republican from 2001 to 2009. Obviously, 2001 was a very big year for, you know, for America. Not, well, actually, not only America, but the world. Because, uh, you know, remember 9-11? Yep, because... Uh, some of you guys weren't even born. Well, actually, well, yeah. Most of you guys were born, but, you know, hardly remember that day. That fateful, fateful Wednesday morning. I can kind of remember, but... Um, from what I can remember is that I was at the babysitters on that day. So... So yeah, there's that. Um, so right before we jump into, well, actually, yeah, we'll we'll jump into this real real quick. Um, he is one of the former living presidents, obviously. His dad was George H. W. Bush, which we talked about two days ago on uh, Friday, I do believe. Is that correct? Uh, yes, it is. We talked about his dad on Friday, George H.W. Bush. So, uh, yeah, he is currently, uh, 72 years old, the same age as Bill Clinton. All right, so, uh, okay, let's see here. We have, let's see here, three, seven, okay. So we have six facts about him for you today. So let us begin. Number one, he is the only president to have a MBA or Master of Business Administration. Yep. Number two, his grandfather, Prescott Bush, was a senator from Connecticut. Number three, when he was governor of Texas, he pushed through legislation that helped Texas to become the number one producer of wind-powered energy in the country. Yeah. Number four, and this is the reason why we played, this is what the opening was about. He likes Mexican food and Paralines and cream ice cream. Robot chicken was right on. <laughs> um, that little bit that we played at the intro, that was uh, robot chicken. In case you didn't hear the little static at the end of it, right before I started talking. <clears throat> uh, number five. He was nearly assassinated when a man threw a grenade at him in 2005. Luckily, it didn't explode. Cause then that would that would, well, nah, that would mean we'll have uh, uh, who was his vice president? Dick Cheney. Uh, I I I think that's what his vice president was. Pretty sure it was Dick Cheney. Uh, yeah, Dick Cheney was his vice president. That means Dick Cheney becomes his vice president. Um, and lastly, 
Number six. He was an avid jogger while in office and even ran a marathon once. Yeah. So, uh, thank you so much for watching today's episode. And tomorrow we'll talk about the most recent Democratic president, Barack Obama. Coming up in four videos and 24 hours. See you later. We've come so far, Washington. Come so far.